15 miles south of Atlanta's airport, production is moving ahead. Movies and TV shows are being made at the former Pinewood Studios, now Trillith. A community is quickly growing around it. As you drive up, you see a new spectacular tribute to an inspirational actor and film, groundbreaking. The town of Trillith CEO Rob Parker showed our Cheryl Preheim around. Here, creativity is a cornerstone of community. For imagination, and art is such a huge piece of that. So we took the white space on the side of one of our stages and said, you know what, what if we just use that as a canvas? And we're real excited with the artist that we were, that was able to do that for us. Let's start painting. <laughs> Brandon Sadler is a one-man team. Over seven days, he used 250 cans of paint to bring 118,000 square feet to life. We believe the largest mural uh, in Georgia is the same artist that was able to do the artwork in the Black Panther movie, which was in part shot on location here. So the pattern work is like uh, inspired by Nigerian fabrics and um, African masks, and I put those two together to make the imagery for Black Panther. And so I kind of did the same thing for this. The importance of the Black Panther film, especially at a time when we're working so hard to come together as a nation, that's just a really important movie for us. And so to be part of the Georgia history with that uh, and to be able to document some of that and capture it on the side of a, a soundstage was really important to us. A building now wrapped in a tribute to Black Panther and to Chadwick Boseman, who died of cancer. Yeah, Chadwick Boseman was an inspiration for a whole generation. So we're just excited to be able to have uh, some of that uh, reflected uh, here at Trillith. It kind of envelops you and you forget that there's a building there. Artwork to inspire a community of creativity. And remember that artist's name, Brandon Sadler. I thought it was just fitting full circle moment for them to bring back the same artist who did the artwork in the Black Panther movie to create this huge mural. Um, just fantastic to see that in the community. And I, you know, I just finished watching Moraney's Black Bottom, one of his Chadwick Boseman's last films. Um, just amazing, Fran, that he was able to work uh, for so long while still being silently ill. Yes, and that's the biggest mm -hmm. thing she, but aside from this film being, uh, making history for not only Georgia and the community, but of course for people of color seeing themselves on this big screen multiple times, multiple lead roles. Whenever those folks at Trillith Park look up and they see this mural, it's about his personal story. It's so much more than Black Panther. It is about the ambition and, and the wherewithal that Chadwick Boseman still mustered up in the yeah. final stages of his life. So when you look at that mural, it's definitely okay. His story history was made with Black Panther, but it is wow. It is he kept going and I think that is the beauty of this mural for me. Resilience. Yeah. That's what we take away this morning. Let's send it on over to Melissa.